Hello Wanderers and welcome back to the Commonwealth. Thanks for joining me today as we take a look at Apocalypse Chow by DJ Redcap1, a food and recipes mod for Fallout 4 on the Xbox One and PS4. According to the description, this is a simple crafting and recipe mod which adds some 70 plus new and altered items to the Commonwealth, including new foods, baked potatoes, cram chowder, and lots more, tribal style healing chems from past Fallout games, healing powder, bitter drink, bandages, usable and craftable soaps, a few types of tea, and quite a bit more. Several new outfits have been added to the scavenger's workbench. Some highlights include trail lunches, various meals packed into VTech lunchboxes, lunchbox is reusable, wasteland stew, and a few other recipes which can be made from whatever might be handy. Cannibal now gives leftovers which can be scrapped for leather, bone, and oil or used in cooking. Ugh. This mod also adds a scavenger's workbench to craft gear like a rebreather for underwater exploration. Trinkets, which are small personal items which you might keep on your person. Each has a small bonus. The food sanitizer returns. This mod also removed the local leader requirement for building crafting stations, but you still need LL2 for stores. It adds a few tribal decorations to your workshop menu, and it uses solely vanilla assets, which is always a good thing. I find it really great that Fallout 4 has a food crafting menu where you can come up with recipes and collect different foods around the wasteland to create new ones. But I always did feel like it was lacking in the amount and types of recipes available. So a small mod like this that just adds a little variety to the meals that you can prepare really makes me want to play with that aspect of the game a lot more. I do find that these items look great in game and I can't wait to go around the wasteland picking up ingredients so that I can cook up some nice meals in my settlements. Despite having a great settlement and crafting system, 
Fallout 4 definitely falls short in having enough items on the list to craft and decorate with as well as consume. So I definitely rely on mods in order to pepper up those menus and make everything a little bit more interesting and populated. That being said, I mean, a lot of these recipes are variations of what you would find in your original Fallout. So this is something that you could install later in the game once you've gone through all the vanilla options and exhausted them as well. I love that they've added making Wastelander soap to this mod. It's a very Fight Club detail to put in there. Although I'm not sure I have the stomach for kitten tenders. Thank you so much for joining me for this look at Apocalypse Chow on the Xbox One and PS4. You can find the Beth Net link down below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And until the next one, friends, stay safe, stay well fed, and happy wanderings.